Hello, everyone. I am just getting ready to clean the wounds of God. And I thought I would show you how. I do it so that if you ever have to do it, you can see how to do it. I use just plain warm water, not too hot or cold, that way it's more comfortable. Anyway, what is my chair as you are doing that? I will. Thank you, Mom. I haven't even had breakfast yet. Yeah, well, I'm talking on the video, Mom. Um, and uh, I still have chores to do. Oh, boy, I got to let I'm going to clean this so I can get some sugar. Dot is just getting herself in position. But I will move her a bit so that um, you can see how it's done. I need my coffee. The cats were up at 5 a.m. wanting to be fed. So... I need some coffee. Give me some energy. She's right over here. But I'm going to move a bit so that you can see what's being done. Anyway. Oh, there's taste of coffee. Oh, that's good. Anyway, it's going to be difficult because I got a black kitty sitting there too, where I usually would have my leg. And I'll place her like this. Good boy, little girl, I mean. Good little girl. I gotta remember, I gotta think opposite the way that I would. Anyway, I use a baby washcloth. They're softer. And uh, it's just get her to turn. See the wounds on her? They, 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 they gotta be washed. Kept clean. Yeah. And this is the first washing since she got up and ate. So I wanna make sure they're good and clean. Uh, because sometimes when they sleep, if they've gone pee during the night, they might end up with some of that on it. But this is the pussy cats all getting this is what I have to do and I do it a couple times a day. Can you see? See she's even trying to wash them. It softens up the scarring and because this all here is dead flesh, the just a second, my arm is in the way. This all, this big piece here, is all necrotic flesh. It will, it's like a big scab now, and is largely coming off. And underneath this is uh, scar tissue, like these ones are doing. 
this will all eventually heal, but it'll be scar tissue. And she doesn't have any more nipples. They're all gone. She's trying to get these big scabs off herself. And uh, that makes it bleed a little bit. So I changed her bed today already. And to you, my brothers and sisters. And that's because she had dead babies inside her. Uh, that figured it out because when he had her overnight to see how she she would be they were born and all of them were very very dead they probably had been in her for a while but this is all see this piece is this this is going to come off soon, this piece listening up she keeps looking life. at and and the more you wash it the easier it comes off with less trauma so i soak it it softens it up and it, uh, you get little bits off here and there that way i don't want to pull this because that will be I wonder if I could cut. There's a big piece that's hanging, and it's going to get caught. So I am going to just have to find my scissors, whatever. Maybe I didn't get them out. Maybe they are out here somewhere. Oh, here they are, Mom. Poor baby. I'm just gonna because it's sticking out so much, it's all dead. I don't want it to pull. And uh, see that? That was all sticking up and pulling. I don't want it to pull and and uh, cause the press and this way I can also clean underneath if uh, you uh, watched our was it the afternoon or evening we gave her the tablet middle of the day middle of the day Back and cheese. yeah the the middle of the day she gets her antibiotic she gets a half a pill Every day, they're strong antibiotics. She eats it and uh, she's all around. Um, anyway, it's hard to hear two people talking at once. Uh, anyway, um, she gets her antibiotic in the middle of the day. And we found that the um, sliced cheese, you know that baking stuff craft, slices or singles they call them that are wrapped in the um, plastic she loves that stuff and i take her half pill and uh, you wrap it in that and she takes it right down that may work for you if you have trouble giving the pill. Anyway, you can see how sore this is, I, I think. Uh, it's just, it's so sad to see this is oozing. But I gently clean it. And I gotta do all of them. And she's doing it too. She's washing herself too. Poor baby. I didn't know you were pregnant and they were all dead inside you. It, it happened so quick because one day I noticed. She's swelling, bloating, like, not normal. I thought, jeepers, if she's pregnant, that's 
really getting fat quick. And then I noticed her boobs becoming very prominent and then starting to bleed. And that was like within four days. And the, the, the kittens were very tiny. Because I, 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 I couldn't figure it out because she'd been in heat for over a month. And uh, then four days later, this starts. And I guess, I don't know what happened. The, the kittens were very tiny. Maybe about a week at most. I'd be trying to keep the kitties away. Once this is all healed and she's stronger, she will be spayed because she can't nurse any kitties. And, and uh, she should be spayed anyway. And I think the next time I'm able to get a ride, I'm going to take a couple of the other cats in the females. There's, there is two more females. Over all these virtues, put on love, which binds the rest together, makes them perfect. There's Daisy and the one Tabby, that's the mother of these ones. I have to actually wait another two weeks to do them. Rich as it is, but I will take Rosie in. Or not Rosie. I keep calling him Rosie. Daisy I'll, is a girl. Rosie was my boy. That's the way. I'll take Daisy in. Oh, for me. Do it in the name of the Lord Jesus. Next week. Give thanks to God the Father through him. By then. These are about six weeks, or, or sorry, these ones are about going on three weeks now. So I gotta wait at least one more week, and then we can do uh, the mama cat. But uh, Daisy, I can take in next week, and I will. I might have to take a taxi, but I don't want this happening. And we gotta take um, the other tabby and the two tuxes in later. I'll do the girls first, just in case. Oh, Everything happened so quick. They were so tiny. Just in March, I had brought in Cammy, and he thought she was too young, and she was all about the same size as these guys at that time. That was just March. Cammy and Gramps got done. Truly, I have set my soul. And I'm very uh, cautious on rushing to do boy cats. Because if you do them too early, it can affect how they can feed and everything. Uh, these guys were just kittens when we brought them in. Uh, I think it was in November. <laughs> so... And they were very feral, too, at that time. It took us a bit of effort to socialize them. I'm surprised Dot is being so mild-tempered. This is slowly, very slowly. Removing the dead necrotic tissue in a way that uh, will cause it to bleed. Oh, 
Oh, sorry, my TV's on in the background. Uh, Darla, that's just mass. I'm trying to listen to it while I'm doing this. I like to listen to it every day. It calms me. I'm not able really to see comments. I will respond to comments after because I'm trying to concentrate on her. Hey, little girl. Jesus said to his disciples, Poor little mama. I warn you, do not All be your concerned baby's for dead your life what and, you and are to eat inside or you. for your body what That's you what are cost to us and our hormones life went crazy. Life is more important than food and the body and more than gold. Because of the dead kittens, the this happened. They, do not they, they, were, they had to have been in her they for a couple of days. How much more important you are than you got infected. Which of you, yes. my worrying, can add a moment to his lifespan? Yeah. If the smallest things are beyond that your power, so why be anxious That's about the rest? Sense. Or take the lilies. They do not spin. They do not weave. But I tell you, Solomon in all his splendor was not arrayed. Like she likes them. getting lost. Oh, look at her. She's licking my fingers. Splendor, she likes this. This feels good. It feels good to her. How much more will he and it will help you? her because it's slowly today. removing the dead skin. And keeping the area clean. Of this world are always and like I said, I don't things. use soap. Your just, father knows just that you need such things. Good God warm water. Over you, and the rest will follow Mom, in turn. can you get me another container? Yeah, this is no, going no, cold. And I'll just pet her for a bit. I want to do some more. It's it's coming off nicely, very slowly. And uh, she loves it. She's so happy to, to get washed. I give the, the washcloth a rinse too. Okay. Yeah, it's her okay, daughter little Terry, girl. one of ten, it's one okay. of ten of Evelyn's uh, of Evelyn's children, wrote a book about her mother Evelyn, and growing up in the fifties and sixties, and how. Her mother helped to make ends meet for the ten. Actually, children. I'll use another washcloth. The title of the book you is can, you the can uh, of Defiance, Ohio. give that um, one a good rinse. Kids. And it can, we got to do the bedding class. anyway. It's got to be all washed. That could be washed was together the with their bedding. When advertisers yeah, they got fresh bedding this jingles, morning. Little catchphrases. I fed the kids. The kitties liked, were up at five, use, wanting to be fed. And they all got fed and, and well, cuddled, and now they're sleeping. Their bellies are full. And so, as she is at the ironing board, she kept a notebook. Yeah. And she would write these little jingles. And she would She's send a good them girl. In. Sometimes she loves the names. attention. She craves Sometimes the attention. Because she's got to stay in the and cage. The, the book is quite a, I don't want her. Because they're a couple aggressive cats that think they're playing. Uh, but with her tummy like this, birthday. I don't want her to accidentally get scratched. And I, it just seemed to come at the right and time when a toaster conked out. Thank there was you. a forgotten prize she had entered that now she Mom, had that's a even colder for. than what I had. Or okay. what warm the, the hot. Was calling on a oh. second By the time I hang out my cloth, it's already cooling down. Pepper, but she was a grand prize winner in their national contest. Sorry, thanks for helping, though, Mom. I do appreciate that. And Makes it easier. Her daughter, Terry. Because I can't leave little girl here unattended. So this is where she had 10 minutes to fill up a shopping Don't basket, just one far. basket, with as much as she could in 10 minutes, and she could take that home free. 
and how she planned and strategized with her children. How are we going to do this to get the most? And so she got these long sausages to put on the side so she could pile it even higher. And at the time, it was $411 worth of groceries. They estimate about worth $3,000 she was able to pile up and feed the family. And Terry said, not everyone would have considered that a major win, this shopping spree, but for mom, it was an answer to our prayers. So how she would use her ingenuity and prayer to come up with a way to be able to make ends meet. And I admire yeah, that's families a little bit today. Better. It could have Dallas even been warmer. Because as soon as I ring this cloth really off, it starts to cool. A testament already. that they trust in Providence. That God is going to help them to provide for these little yeah. ones. And often really the fathers good. have to come up with ways yeah. to get additional funds to help provide for their families. You know, and yet the there's a good trust in God's providence that this he's going to give them inspiration and I can so reach give them this guidance one. to help them to provide for these yeah, children that, that they hard to to this their one. care. Oh, look at that. Today's that saints so on the sore. Franciscan calendar we celebrate as a so feast sore, the St. Felix of Cantalice. Mm, and for 40 years in Rome, he was the quester for the Capuchins, which meant that he had to go and beg for their needs every day. And he did it for 40 years. Do you imagine that even going be out warmer. door to door and really asking for the needs of the Yeah, but if you have the, the cold water well also warm, no, it, it, it takes, but yeah, but if you were using the cold water, to be an and it takes a while for it to get hot. Together with Philip Neary, who was a, a friend of his in Rome at the time. Because by the time I got it ringed out, it's already cool call people to faith, to conversion. And the warmer water and they were known for their is easier so to St. Felix would have to depend on to providence, God's everything. providence every day. And it feels and good. Would open people's oh, hearts she loves the doors To enable mm -hmm. him to collect what was needed for the community's needs, as well as for the poor that he would encounter. He was very generous with them. His name is Felix, which means happy, yeah. and our entrance at the front today is spoken with the joy and thanksgiving that St. Paul this spoke is our day in today's routine first reading with this from his letter to the Colossians. In fact, Paul, twice a day, letter, actually. he so often does. I'll do it again in the evening. He so often speaks of thanksgiving. St. Felix was known as Brother Deo so Gracias because he was always saying Deo Gracias, Deo Took Gracias. a good half hour Thanks just to, to feed the little Thanks kittens because they were numbers. hungry Brother Deo and they Gracias. all wanted to be cuddled. And so what did St. Paul write to the Colossians? And I had to wash them too. Today. <clears throat> he said dedicate yourselves wash to thankfulness. Their Faces and their arms the and legs Christ, and, is, and tummies and their bum bums. Sing gratefully to God. Yeah, that helps them also to go pee when you songs, when you uh, wash their and bums and genitals because it stimulates so they can go pee to God after, from your hearts. which they need to do. And gratitude really is. The song of Soon heaven. they'll get used to Eternal doing it. You won't that have God to. Has brought us into existence, but as of for at us. this time, I still and do. most importantly, He's provided for our eternal welfare. Things oh, may not this always is a go terrible, well for us. Terrible, terrible scar. If you could see it, this whole dark area here, this whole dark but area. That's all one big scab. Nothing compared to the glory it's that's about going to be revealed in us. One and a half so we can inches. Trust. God is faithful. He is one way word. and over two He's inches the other way. Because it's he doesn't abandon scab. us. He does never forsake us. All he is skin. trustworthy. He is faithful to us. And we can trust him. And even in the troubles of our lives, we but by say, doing this slowly, somehow, gradually, you are turning this it loosens to my up and, and comes this off. To my spiritual welfare in this life, I don't want to cause her any trauma. Some people might try so and Jesus just pull it off. 
a done as he could lead and it tells us not be good. Really Doing it this way value. is the way. I, I talked to the doctor the about heaven. that. And then everything else is going to be provided for you. And four times it could be translated in today's reading. He says, stop worrying. Don't worry. Your life is more than food and clothing. Your life is meant to share in the glory of the Lord, to already know the Lord. And if the smallest things are beyond your power, why be anxious about the rest? Anyway. So ultimately, we are bad and we have to trust to surrender ourselves to the Lord and trust in his providential care for us. Again, whatever may happen, the difficulties, the challenges, the joys of our lives, routine. God will beautifully blend and doing it all this, I do this for our spiritual day. growth and for our eternal will welfare. Again in the and evening. we can trust him. We can be but like I thought I would show you what some call you can see him. I've already been at it Dale for 26 minutes. Thanks be to and, God. Uh, there's still when a lot people to reviled be. him, he would say, I pray God that a you become a saint. Loosening up and coming on. So we do not return evil for evil. It le loosens up gently this way. Humble work for 40 years, which shows it's us hard to show that even the smallest but tasks that are done with love. By gently rubbing like this. Value. He was building his treasure in heaven. Not a you can't on see it online, and but so now you can see the little flakes and bits of coming off. Hey, may he pray for us. And if she laid in anything, that, that comes up off to them. We dedicate ourselves to thankful, thankfulness, singing gratefully to God from our hearts in psalms, hymns, Poor and baby. inspired songs. Let's take a look at this one. This one looks like it's really coming along. Yeah. Whoops, you're going to slip over. You don't want you slipping and falling. The numbers got a vacuum because that ground is dirty. With confidence in God's power and love, the manifest of the resurrection days. of Christ. It's hard to find the time when you're doing that this the church every may day. follow where Christ has led and find all its hope, its I glory in heaven. Day she came we pray to the Lord. But that our Holy Father we had a may be encouraged by the loyal here. support of his fellow bishops and the work and, of evangelization. Uh, we pray to the Lord. Yeah. For all here present, for those who have asked for our prayers, Good. that the Lord Tribs may increase our trust in His love and providential care. Is that ever the feeding? Lord. I have for to keep couples, two feeding stations that they may grow for these guys. Love, reflect that some will eat in the kitchen and some will eat in here. We pray to the Lord. For those who have died, that Jesus, who laid down His life for the flock, may bring them home to the Father's house. We pray to the Lord. Lord Loving Father, our heart is glad yeah, our soul rejoices in our body of light and confidence. That dark, because you never abandon those dead you black have stuff by Christ, off. through Christ. Wow, well, almost blood. It's dried blood. Dried dead flesh. I noticed that after I wash, she goes with her tongue, and her tongue, a cat's tongue is rough, and it can pull off more of the uh, dead stuff. And she won't pull, she just licks. There's a bit that you see. I think I will. Is it there? It was here. I guess I won't be cutting it off. I don't know. Did it fall? 
I had a monkey up here. Um, you like green sissy? It's there yet. You just your yeah, I know. I thought I had it over here. But then Sparky came up here. I wonder if it fell. Oh, yeah. There it is. I found it. Yeah, Sparky knocked it over. It's okay. Everything's okay. Okay. I'm just gonna get this. Or this. See, that's a piece of the scab that the, the, the dead necrotic, necrotic flesh that had lifted. Now, where did I put the. I tell you, my head is. There it is. My head is uh, not functioning well. From all the lack of sleep. Taking care of three babies that were rejected by their mama. And uh, now this. Next month we'll take her. She should be okay by next month. But uh, I want to take in uh, Daisy as soon as possible. We'll take uh, um, uh, Honey in too. The mama will have to wait another week at least. And uh, they, we're going to be basically taking, um, cause it, uh, if we take, it, well, if we take a taxi, we can do that. Yeah. But if it's, it's can be so I will cover that so that they can't escape. I have something I think that'll fit just on top. They got the holes they can look through. We'll leave them. We'll leave them. Uh, um, we'll leave them some toys in there. I still Father, wouldn't leave him alone if I had the playpen because the older cats could jump in. And bring him to experience on this earth the gifts you promise in the new world. And we'll take out your rocker, we'll clean that area and up. So with all the and I can make that and into a nice yeah, little rocker. Yeah, that's your outside rocker. You brought it in so that it would. Winterize. Yeah, you didn't want it out in the winter because it's got fabric. And you ended up using it. Oh, and I tell you, the cats love it. Yeah, the cats like to sleep on. It's comfortable, I guess. Look at him. You poor baby. But she's doing better today. Seeing as it's weekend. Now on the 28th, we have appointments. So if we're going to take uh, Daisy in, we could do Honey at the same time. Those two will take in on Monday. 
A male is easier to do. You want to see? Huh? A male is easier to do. Yes. But we got to get Daisy in. I'm worried about her getting pregnant. Um. Never the only other one beside yourself. her so that is this one and the mama. And the mama, we have to wait at least another week. That's going to be fun bringing her in. She's not friendly. I think she will end up being a TNR. She was in during the winter, but the night, was she's not happy in here, and she's very aggressive. You know what? Some of them we can let in and out. If she wants to come back in, she can come back in. But then she better behave. Um, at least as a TNR, because she was out there. Um, she's feral. Um, as a TNR, then we won't be getting new ones coming. Because when you remove one, another one usually fills its space. And I can't afford to TNR the whole time. I just want to control the kitties in this area. This one, will, yeah. This one will probably have to stay in. She's friendly anyway. I could probably adopt her out. She is friendly. She'll never be able to have kittens, and uh, she is as friendly. She's a sweetheart. Oh, I can't believe how much of this is coming off. It works better though when the water is warm. This is getting colder. But she's getting that blood. Come on to this cold seat. And it, will, it must itch terrible. I can imagine. You know how scabs can itch. Can you imagine that this itch is like? And as we look forward to this second coming, we Did offer you, you in thanksgiving to this holy and living sacrifice. Saturday? Lord, we pray upon the oblation of your church okay, and recognizing you the sacrificial Let's victim. talk about it later. Yeah, okay. to reconcile us I'm to not yourself. sure what I want. Grant that we are really by the body and blood of your You're son. You're still coming and getting over spirit. whatever the heck Maybe it was I had. Maybe one body, one spirit in Christ. May he make of us an eternal offering and those to you, pills don't so help. that we may obtain an inheritance with your elect, especially with the most blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with blessed Joseph, her spouse, with the blessed apostles Maybe and glorious kids. martyrs, with Saint Felix yeah. of Contemplation, you got all the mix. with all the saints mm -hmm. on his Just constant intercession mix. in your presence. And we can have those strawberries with them. May the sacrifice of our and any leftovers, you know, the strays love. Anytime we make pancakes and we had leftovers, we just cut it all up and put it out. Yeah, well, they were strays, they were getting it. Listen graciously to the prayers and, of the US um, and before. They just ask them, especially if you put a little bit of uh, your syrup, syrup on them. The world. To they just go nuts over it. So there's and nothing ever wasted. There we hope to enjoy the spaghetti of your glory. Yeah, the, they they love spaghetti to too. There's, the there's the none left. Right now. No, we can't have any real waste because they eat everything. <laughs> yeah. Well, there's nothing that we will waste. We have chicken for today for lunch. I can eat a tiny bit of meat now. But not much. Very little. Most of what I eat is still vegetarian. But I'm slowly getting 
my iron levels and, and B levels back up. I was eating a little bit. It's mostly fish that I eat. Sometimes a little chicken. My iron levels are improving too. As long as I only eat a little bit. Like an ounce or two. But I sure can't handle the fat. It's got to be lean, whatever I eat. Because as soon as I eat anything fat, I'm sick as a dog. And anything really heavy, if I try eating anything real heavy, I get sick. The worst, it's it's not as bad now. It seems like it was worse when I was on that other pill. But they've taken me off of that. And uh, it is a little bit better. Oh boy, look at how much junk we removed today. If I keep this up, maybe in about a week, this will be all cleaned off. It's, it, you can't see it on there, but there's little bits here and there. One more go there, okay, Dot? And then I think I'll cuddle you for a little bit. I don't want to make you sore. I'm sure I'm seeing it come off. It's flaking off. This poor little girl has to go through this every day. Oh, look, she likes her leg wash, too. I'm yeah, you can see it's loosening. Now it'll continue to loosen. Anyway, it's getting this nasty, nasty. Broken stuff off of her. I'm cleaning the whole area where it seeps. I don't want to use anything. That'll sting because this is such a huge area that would be horrible for her. That's why I use very hot water. Very hot water. It cleans the rag better. Can you get me some more hot water? I'll do one more bout. You gonna, some more? Oh, you got. Oh, I yet. still got. I haven't hardly had any. I'm gonna get another cup of coffee too. I can do both. <laughs> yeah. But make sure it's really, really hot. Okay. I'm not kidding. Really hot, steaming hot water. And when I put the rag in, then it it that rag will be cold. But yes, and it goes cool really quick. And so I squeeze it out. And I want this rag to be kept clean. It's really coming off now. Loosening up bits here and there. Oh, yes. Oh, you heard something that got your attention? Hey, little girl. Yeah. yeah I'm going to do one more time. Mom's getting another thing of water because that was looking murky. And you want me to do this side a little bit? Oh, I've really been going on this one. Mm -hmm. I will seek the Lord shall praise him. 
May your hearts be forever joyful. And gently, I guess the word is abrades it off. It gently lifts oh, it off. Yes, I'm making my coffee. As soon as I make my coffee, my Jesus little boy wants his coffee. coffee. Okay, that's hot and steamy. Oh, oh, that's cold. It's cold. It's got to be, run it, run. You don't have it on the filter, do you? Okay, run it full strength. For a long time till you the see the water the steaming. Say but the word and my soul shall be healed. Just the hot water. Don't use any cold water in there. Dump what you got there and then try again. That's no way. It's cold outside, Mom. That water comes in, it's ice cold. Takes a good Son while. Jesus, sanctify me. Body okay. Of Jesus, save me. Blood of Jesus, wash me. Water out of the side of Jesus, purify me. Blood I think Mom's Jesus, worried about her getting burned. She doesn't oh, realize Jesus, how quickly Hide this cools everything down. O oh, sacred heart of Jesus, receive me. Immaculate heart of Mary. That's a little bit better. That, I wouldn't call that. It should be steaming. Hot. Okay. I'll next can, time. Can, can you get steaming that's, that's, hot? Yes, because as soon as I put my rag in there, it's going to be cold. Steaming hot. I would go do it myself, but I got her here, and I dare not leave her alone. In case she tries to wander, and I don't want her getting stuck under one of the beds or anything, or going in, I don't want her to go in the litter box, I give her a pee pad instead, so that she doesn't get litter on it. I'm trying to keep her clean, and this ground needs to be vacuumed. Been. Well, I vacuumed it the day she came home, but these guys have been busy making messes. <laughs> Steaming hot this time? I don't want to burn you. Mom, I don't get burnt like you do. I I can handle it. I washed dishes for several years. Is hot enough? Yeah, that's better, I guess. See, as soon as this goes in, right away it's cooled down. Hey. Trust me. See, now it's just warm. Just warm. Yeah. Oh, that feels good, eh? Oh, you should hear, hear her purr now. Warm water instead of cold. And that works so much quicker. The warm water just loosens everything. Much, much quicker. Mom, watch the language. There's kids also listening. She's, she was giving uh, one of her babies. That's a troublemaker, heck. Because um, he was acting up. I 
I think he wants you to pick him up and let him see. Oh, what was he going to do? Uh -uh, oh, no, we don't do that. Yeah, I got to start using that spray I got that keeps them from doing that. When I used that with the other group, it really helped prevent that. He is, uh, he is, uh, a troublemaker, I know. He's a funny monkey. He's very friendly, but he gets into trouble. He's a troublemaker. Oh, yes, this is really working now. Because it's warm, it's not cold. Oh, and you should feel her purring. Oh, she's purring. Yeah, we finished the pot of coffee. <laughs> well, I have a half a cup here. Oh, I'll make some tea afterwards. Okay. I'm only on my second cup myself. Yeah. So you had two and a half? I had one and a half. Yeah, but your mug is like twice the size of mine. Yeah, it's, it's enough. I'll make some tea. So, if we were to go by normal sized mugs, mine is just a little bit bigger than a normal size, but yours is twice the size. Yeah. That's my max. I can't have too much. At least for this one, I can have some. With this medicine that I'm on now. <laughs> but I don't know. They might have to increase it a little bit or something. Maybe instead of three times a day, I'll take two twice a day <laughs> or something. Because I'm still having the seizures. And it looks like my leg isn't going to get as bad. It's a different brand. Mm -hmm. It's the same basic medicine, but a different brand. Watch him. He's, hey, what are you up to? He's going to go into your garbage there. There's nothing in there but uh, your bubblegum empty container and the uh, fire. Yeah, you know how noisy he is. Uh, just just get him off of there. I really don't like him on there. Get off. <laughs> oh, God. Who would have all his people to be saved? That's and where I'm going to be storing my computer. Send forth and beseech you, labor into your home. hearts, and grant them with all confidence to preach the word, that everywhere your gospel may be heard and glorified. And that all nations may know you, the one true God, and him whom you have sent, Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord. Amen. Oh, you love this. The concept of the family in today's world is not how to calm she is. You should feel her purring. She I likes left this. The road my mom, this must feel my real good. And my brother. It must. They have been poor in my when as soon as I start doing this, she rubs. Look at this. As a family, we encourage each other. It must to feel good to get Jesus that Christ. dead skin off. Mm -hmm. Dead flesh. It's love, not just skin; it's but it's flesh. It's what he gave us to grow. What he gave us to become the people he wants us to be. It'll take a while for this one to be Family completely gone, is where the faith begins. but the other ones are definitely getting. What's this one? Looks like it's lifting. It's oh yeah, you grab my washcloth. She wants your face washed too, Nancy. Your face too. 
She's clean all over. She's clean all over. She's good at washing herself. Can there be anything more she's really going after that one tooth. And I God see it is lifting and gaining. I'm going to hold this for a second to gain it. But who actually pray. The word of God teaches us that we are to be at one with one another, lest our prayers be hindered. Yeah, it is. So okay. But you know what? I want to leave because it's starting to ooze. And where we say to one another in our marriage and in our families so that he's essential to what we're doing. We must make time to pray without compromise. In our marriage, there's three people in this marriage. It's Jim, it's Joy, and it's Jesus. It's a big we wouldn't overhead. be married for 32 years if we did not I, I will take that day, off. pray. We She's pray been morning, working at it all day. day. We have done premarital all morning, counseling. But I got to have your move so that and I can do this. I don't want to hurt you. Praying with their spouse. It is a power. It is, there's so much power in prayer that we have yeah. over each other and for our children. And the more God the dad stuff you can take and does off, miracles. the better. You know, there are various forms of prayer, whether it's the rosary or chaplet of divine mercy or some sort of devotion that you're doing. We've done all sorts of prayer. But the key thing oh, again, is that you know. pray. It just might be for a moment at the beginning of the day and at the close of the day. But it so washes you and delivers the couple from, yes, I believe it's in the power. And it just fortifies the marriage. It might be as simple as just speaking a blessing and, and touch I'm one another some. like this. Joy, I bless you this day. That's happy. May God's will be done in your life. And that he help me to facilitate yes. his plan for your life. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, I bless you and cover you as your husband. Amen. And Jim, I bless you, and we pray God's richest plans upon us in all that we do today, that he would That's go before us, bit. that he would be the light this and the lamp this unto us. Still tight. And Jim, I bless you in the this name is of the Father, take and the Son, oh, oh, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. It's starting. Marriage and family is God's plan. Okay, let me let me wash that area. And prayer is the fuel to quite that a bit of God bless you. Make sure that's clean. It's coming off. It's all coming off. Oh, is that ever nasty? I'm Joan, and this is my role. But it's it's forming skin. Welcome to Joan's role. Today we're visiting a basilica with a very, very beautiful story. I just story. don't want to force it because you know, I don't want it to visits, be the the Emperor Constantine sad. was responsible for building a lot of the basilicas in Rome. However, oh, actually his mother, St. Helena, her. was very much behind yeah, the building God, of this basilica. Off on that side. Both Helena and Constantine were converted to Christianity mm -hmm. when, in a dream, before a battle the Emperor was going to fight, he saw a cross. And a voice said to him, you will win in this sign. Well, that sign was the cross. It was the sign of Christianity. So this is my day. Christianity. And actually, the Holy Land, the I cross, do this every God's day for relics of his passion. Twice were a white, day. Were most in their minds. I also do the same thing. When both the emperor and his mother, Helena, at a very advanced age, I to might say, sure went to the Holy Land to look for these clean. relics. Now today in this basilica, which by the way, the emperor had built over the home where his mm -hmm. mother lived, the she brought one. relics back to Rome and she created a little chapel in her home to house some of the relics. Obviously, with the passage of time, a new basilica was built. There's a new and beautiful and wonderful chapel that houses the relics. As you enter this Once church today, it softens Holy Cross up, in Jerusalem, it you would go to the left side batter, of the basilica, walk up, and go into a door, walk up another short entrance, and you're in a very beautiful room removed. where a glass enclosed case has a nail. Several pieces of the crown of thorns. Yeah, and I can the see this in the next we day or so. Start but before you even get to that now. relic room, there's a wonderful cross bar from the cross of the good thief, St. Dismas. That's what you see as you first get into this passageway to walk up to the relic room. 
And one of the other foremost relics is, of course, the piece of wood inscribed with the word Jesus of Nazareth, King of the Jews, okay, that was at the top of the cross side. over Jesus' head, Complained as we know. Now, St. Helena, why is it called Holy Cross in Jerusalem? It's because St. Helena brought back a lot of soil from Jerusalem when she came back from one of her many trips. Her last, she fulfilled at the age of 80. She brought back the soil and she put it on the floor of this little chapel she created for Christ's relics. And some of that original soil can yeah, be seen today from the Holy Man. So that's when you come to Rome, there are so many yeah, churches and major basilicas to visit, but yeah. this has to be on your itinerary. And by the way, How about Holy we give you a little is not far from St. John Lennon. Yeah. So come to Rome, visit this beautiful yeah. church, closely tied to the cross of Christ. For more insights into the daily life here in Rome, check out my daily blog, Jones Rome. I Not really, you know, she's good at cleaning herself. Anyway, let's have a little cuddle time. Okay. That's enough cleaning. That's enough cleaning. Now we can have some cuddle time. I'll give you a little, a little cuddle here. Before we go child Jesus, I got a by love and by hope. I have a sleep. You had your breakfast. My troubled heart. Let your own you got a fresh pea pad in there. Mitigate my troubles. And if you get some water in there, take from me. And I put some nice toys, your favorite little toys in there. And let me never surrender to this Grant me, dear child Can Jesus, the special grace I ask from you today in all humility Mama and, loves you, and, yeah. and for the sake of your sins, yeah, Mama loves you. always hear my prayers. Be generous yeah. with your aid and consolation, mm -hmm. that I may praise you and the Father I'm, and the Holy Spirit. I think for you to have a name. Oh, she didn't want to go back yet. Yeah. It's going to be hard. Oh, you got it. Hello, friends, and welcome to another it's segment. It's too of dangerous out here for you. I'm Father Wade Venezes. I don't want you to get hurt by any of the other kids. And I've got to clean up better on the ground. I don't want you to get hurt by any of the other kids. And I've got to clean up better on the ground. I don't want you to get hurt by any of the other kids. And I've got to clean up better on the ground. Pope St. John Paul II. Pope, the parable of the prodigal son. The parable of the prodigal son. Found in chapter 15 of St. Luke's Gospel, expresses in a simple but profound anyway, way the reality of conversion. That's my day with Dot. And the presence of mercy in the human world. Um, she has to have that done twice a day. I do it in the morning and in the evening. Indeed, the church must confess anyway, and proclaim God's mercy. This mercy is much longer than I expected. Mom, can you just put that on the table? I'm going to get you in this I'm done with heart it heart here. And you can rinse this the off. But that is... Remember, my daily God is always routine to with himself, with dot and now. is even willing to meet each person where they are in the life of faith so respond and with your intellect and your will to God mass is over i feel have a relationship and i'm listening to the background it was a very good news god bless you and thanks for watching ewtn and this segment of the wonders of his mercy anyway I will uh, Hello brothers and sisters, this is Jim. And there Jim is Pinto. nothing on there. We're so blessed to be with you. Okay. I'm going to turn the TV off for a while. I'm gonna go and get changed in the bathroom. Yeah. Gonna... We gotta do some chores. So and we can we can have breakfast and do some chores. But this has been what it's like when I'm when I am 
cleaning dot. That's what it's like. I do it gently. She loves it. As you could see, she was absolutely just loving it. And I had a little cuddle with her. And uh, then I have to unfortunately put her back in her cage. She wants to be free, but the problem is I have a couple cats that she used to always play with, and they can get rough. And I worried about that area getting accidentally scratched or hurt or agitated or dirty. And she might try to use the litter box, and that would get litter all over it. And so she's got to stay in the cage until this is all healed. It probably will take a little longer than I originally thought. But thank you everyone for coming. Mama, Rimmer, Robin, Reynolds, Sally, Loretta, Ovedia, Hansine, Fig, and Chu. I'm sorry if I got it wrong. Vincent was here, Darla. I can't even see everyone. And um, Tina Banks Harris. Well, for all of you who joined and all of you who have been watching, thank you. And um, even after I close this video, I'm saving it. Uh, please come back if you haven't done so already and say hello. When, if you view this video, just put in the comment area, uh, hello. And that way I can see your name and I know then who viewed and watched. And that makes it a little easier for me to figure out who to invite. Anyway, that's Dots. Bath time. And um, like I said, I do that twice a day to help those dead areas. It's it's dead flesh um, to loosen off and, and come off. And and she'll heal much quicker once that's gone. And uh, be able to be free and able to fly. I know she's lonesome in there. That's why I keep her next to me. That way then um, she has company. And uh, I occasionally turn the cage the other way when it's not so crazy bright when the sun is overhead more. I open the window curtains and and she'll be able to look out and, and see the street from here. Anyway, hello Mama Rimmer. This will be saved so you can go back and look. Anyway, um, take care for now. I will continue to keep you guys updated with how things are going. I'm ending this live video now. Take care, everyone. Oh, one more thing. Um, if you want to help cover costs, because I'm going to have such a huge vet bill, any purchases for food or other items for for the, the, the kittens or the strays would be greatly appreciated because I've, I've got to get these. When I first brought in the first one, he said she's too small. They were all at the same size, and that was just in March. So I'm going to take... Um, the remaining older kitties in, not not old, but kittens. They're they're not even a year old yet, or barely a year old, as we figured they were born 
at the end of May. Um, and we're going to have them all neutered and spayed. That's going to take a chunk. So if, if you want to help me, I have wish lists on both Amazon and on Walmart. Any food sent on that wish list is appreciated. Because what I, I can use for um, the older Katie crew and the strays, that also helps because uh, then I don't have to spend that money on buying them food. And I can get that vet bill paid. It's going to be a huge one, especially with this with her. She's letting me pay it off gradually. But uh, I would like to get it done as quickly as possible. So if you want to help, the wish lists are there. And I'll tag them to this post as well, the revised wish lists. Anyway, take care, everyone.